Hey guys, it's Mr. Kilburn, and I dropped some coin on some cool new software to make some videos for you. Hopefully this helps as we gear up for the state test. Um, one of the most common questions that students have, or have problems with rather, is how do I take in a table of values and get an equation? Or how do I want an equation and compare it to a graph? Or all this different kind of slope and y-intercept stuff that sometimes seems to get kind of all jumbled together. So I'm going to walk through a couple of problems and hopefully alleviate and clarify some of the stress you've had with these problems. So the first problem says, how do I can? <laughs> well, let's start with that typo. Okay, it should be get. How do I get an equation from a table of values? All right, well, you've heard me say it many, 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 many times. The first thing you do is figure out the slope. All right, so we know slope is the delta y over delta x, the change in y over change in x. So how do I get from negative 16 to negative 7? How do I get from negative 5 to negative 2? Well, because I have a table, I can just figure out what the pattern is. All right, if I had just two points and not a table, then I'd have to subtract, uh, again, the delta y over delta x. So how do you get from negative 16 to negative 7? You add 9. <clears throat> how do you get from negative 5 to negative 2? You add 3. So the slope is 9 over 3, which reduces to just 3. Okay, now step 2, the formula that you've written down many, many, many times, y equals mx plus b. We just figured out what the slope is, right? 9 over 3 reduced to 3. Um, I don't know the y-intercept yet. So I'm going to substitute in an x and a y and solve for b. So let's pick 3 and 8. Okay, so make sure you plug in um, 3 for x, 8 for y, and solve for b. 8 equals 9 plus b. Subtract 9 to both sides, and you get b equals negative 1. So if this is my slope, whoa, if that's my slope, and that's my y-intercept, must my, be my equation is y equals 3x, minus 1. <clears throat> now you may say, well, wait a minute, right here I can look at the table and get the y-intercept. And you're absolutely right, you could have. But the skill of taking a point and substituting in to figure out what b is, you've got to have that skill. Okay, so that's why I went through it kind of the long way. But you're right, if you can look at the, y the table and get the y-intercept, that's cool too.